Well, Fox Urgent now, a third top executive in the prosecutor's office at the center of the Jussie Smollett case resigning. One of them, Kim Fox's chief ethics officer, April Perry. Fox, the city's top prosecutor, says Perry is the person who told her she should recuse herself from the Smollett case. Her office dropped all the charges against the actor last month, causing outrage from police and Chicago's mayor. They say Smollett lied about a racist, homophobic attack against him. Mike Tobin reporting live from Chicago. Mike. Hey, and Trace, just a short time ago, Fox News learned the departure of a third employee, as you mentioned, from the state's attorney's office. This is a director of external affairs. And this comes as we just learned that the uh, chief ethics officer announced that she is retiring. Now, this chief ethics officer is the person who advised Cook County State's attorney, Kim Fox, that she needed to step away from the Jesse Smollett case. The ethics officer is named April Perry. She gave that recommendation because Fox had contact with family and supporters of Smollett while he was still considered a victim of a hate crime. It is it is now known that Fox never formally recused herself. In fact, texts show that she made recommendations to the deputy prosecutor handling the case. Perry is stepping down to take a private sector job as general counsel in a tech startup. She has always had the support of Kim Fox. We never had an ethics officer in Cook County. What I wanted to make sure when I started my term was that any decision that I made, even the appearance of impropriety, would be vetted by someone other than myself. Matt Rotert, who served the last two years as director of the Conviction Integrity Unit, he announced that he is retiring. He told our Matt Finn that his re he submitted his resignation before these controversies boiled up, and the timing of his, uh, uh, of his uh, retirement now is based on the fact that he's turning 67 years old and he wants to retire. In fact, the specific timing is built around a fishing trip. Now, uh, the Cook County State's Attorney is also handling the case of R&B singer R. Kelly. We got a statement today from uh, State's Attorney Attorney Kim Fox saying, among other things, she wants to ensure that the handling of the Smollett case is transparent to the public, but she will be issuing no further public statements while the inspector general is reviewing her handling of that case. Trace, back to you. Mike Tobin, live for us in Chicago. Mike, thank you.